So my friend had a penis extension, but now his house just looks stupid. It's a thinker. Welcome to Shaven Butcher, the best a man can get in terms of YouTube wet shaving channels. Uh, well, that's not true either. Actually, there's a, a, a whole bunch of channels that are that are better. But anyway, welcome. Today we're shaving with a new razor. Well, it's not newly made, but it's new for me, new to the den. It is a Tan Fuji, which uh, that thing might say, I don't know. Some good focus so everyone can read the Japanese. <laughs> it's a Swedish steel anyway. Um, it's, uh, it's not the best looking uh, razor maybe. But I'm expecting it, expecting it to be fairly good. Um, cool, there it is. So today is uh, Eufros Sanzibar, which has been loaded onto my GA7 brush. I haven't used that in a while, just gonna wet the face, guys. Pre-shave was done with face wash from Nobru and a pre-shave oil from Nobru as well. The sandalwood series. It's an actual sandal sandalwood scent that I that I like. I'm not a big fan otherwise, but the Nobru scent is is good. So a new racer, exciting. And I literally haven't used it before, so I hope it's good. We'll find out. This uh, soap is tallow based, requires quite a bit of moisture. I haven't used it in a while and you know, you tend to forget the particulars of the soap. Does it want to be more wet? Uh, maybe. Well, it, well, it wants to work more. The soap wants to work out, I think. We'll see. I haven't used this soap a lot because I'm not a not crazy about the scent. But a lot of scents, as I've been finding out lately, uh, can be acquired taste. You can feel they're pretty poor and then after a while, after a bit of time, after using it a few times, they can grow on you. Two days of growth, a bit unusual for me. I actually have a sample of the new soap base from Eufros that I haven't used yet. And it's not with me today, but maybe next shave will be with that, we'll see. So, Japanese full hollow. First time I use Japanese full hollow, I have two wedges. Feels good. Lovely sound, isn't it? Mm. Almost always shave every day, so not doing that is is interesting. It's nice for a change.
feel a big difference, you know? Good, good, good. So been out on the road with the family for two days visiting, well, family. Uh, been a beautiful Vecre, which is in the middle of the region of Småland. Småland is where I was born. It's famous for a few things. It's famous mainly for for having inhabitants who are a bit careful with their money. So the Scotland of Sweden, if you will. But they're also good at inventing things like IKEA is from the heart of Småland. Head office is still there. And we had fantastic weather. We got to swim in, in a pretty big, pretty big lake. Usually go swimming in the sea with salty water. So it's nice for a change to do sea water. Nice and warm. I did get a, no, a new soap <clears throat> from Öster Aros, the one Matti used in his latest video, I think, and the one before as well. I haven't tried that out yet. I wanted to try this new racer with a, a soap I know, and the soap I know is really good. So, I shall be trying out the... Öster Aros, which is a new, new Swedish artisan, a guy called Billy from Uppsala. So, pretty cool, you know, new, uh, new local artisans, very interesting. And I have samples, I have one, and getting one sample from two more is Swedish artisan soap makers. Feels good. I think they want to be low profile, so try them out. First time, not on camera. You know what? I think I need more lather. I'm going back to the puck. <gasps> but it was a bit thin. And you can go back to the puck, you know, you really can. <clears throat> yeah, so I know s at least one of you guys think I'm on vacation all the time. Um, it's been a, quite a bit lately, I agree, but I have been saving up. I have been saving up for years. Then again, in Sweden you get quite a bit of vacation. It's all part of the, part of the system. But then most people aren't really free when they're on vacation because they work. most of the time 
anyway. So vacation, smacation. But anyway, uh, today's Saturday, and tomorrow is Sunday, and then on Monday I start working again. And you know, feels okay. You gotta work sometimes, don't you? Mm. A bit of coffee. Second pass. This is when, when you find out. Yeah, that's a good racer. That's a good edge. Keep me quiet because I, I do want to concentrate. Probably why you shouldn't try new stuff and new things on, on camera when you do it for the first time. Sometimes maybe it's interesting for you to see when, when I experience things for the first time as well. Ah. A good attempt to clean things up. So but all the way up the nose. Really attractive. So this is where my my beard is the thickest. At least where the hairs are the coarsest, the hardest. a test for the racer you know <clears throat> my cheeks I can get smooth with with two two simple passes with anything a pair of scissors you know and I, I have quite a bit of hair it's just easy for some reason See, I, I put my finger under here, pretty much all the way through. It's to uh, stretch the skin.
Because two things that I've started doing just in the last year, or maybe a year and a bit, although I have been straight razor shaving for it's four years in total, is being easier, even easier on the touch. No pressure, or as little pressure as possible. And <laughs> I forget the other thing. What was I going to say? Yeah, and not not rushing. Although Frank thinks I'm too slow for his liking. For his entertainment. Yes. And another thing I, I know, knew about but haven't really put in words is something Jill uh, at She Shaves with Jill pointed out. Is that when you finish shaving and you clean up and you dry your face and you wait for a, for a while, 30, 60 minutes, what, where you could feel uh, a bit of residual hair after shaving uh, goes in, you know, shrinks back into the skin. Um, she said why, and I can't remember because I have no attention span, but probably the, the hairs um, dry up because they're, they're moisturized and then they shrink in or something like that. So sometimes you are BBS if you're chasing that, but you can still feel the hairs and you clean up, dry up, wait an hour, and it's BBS. And yeah, yeah. Yeah, man. Wow, that was really good. Je vais rinse. today, no bomb today. Ah shit, missed a bit. Missed a bit. Okay, super dry, no residual slickness. There you have it. So, only a splash today. Lucido from the Mandome Corporation. This just moisturizes your skin in the most typical, sophisticated, slightly understated Japanese way. Ah. Super happy with that. Really, 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 really good. The Tan Fuji. Extra hollow from Swedish steel with the GA7 and the Euphros. You know, the, the razor, the brush, the soap, 
and the strop it was dropped on is all from the same guy. Thank you, my friend. Finishing off with Lucido from the Mandom Corporation, Japan. Sayonara.